Hello, good morning everyone. Finally, it's our first morning at Gosakunda Lake. So we have just walked up and we are now going to have breakfast in our hotel. So this was the hotel where we lived yesterday and this is the, here are the mountain ranges and this is Gosakunda Lake just behind me and this is Bhairavkunda and uh, just uh, just behind this lake there is another lake which is called uh, Saswati Kunda so we have heard that there are more than 108 lakes uh, in this area and we will also be going to another big lake just above this Gosai Kunda lake which is called Surya Kunda and so uh, first we will have uh, tea and breakfast and then we will go uh, up there and there are also uh, services where helicopters uh, people come from Kathmandu in helicopter where are they? I don't know if you can see so here are the peoples with choppers so that's it guys we will uh, in an hour we will reach Surakunda and I will keep you updated from there it's freezing cold but the uh, view of the mountains and the lakes is really magical so that's it guys see you soon Okay guys, now we are doing, I think this is the Kosai Kunda Pass uh, to reach Surya Kunda. So this is the path. I will be showing you throughout this path. Adam. I'm going to go to the pilot.
Now I think we have almost reached the Surya Kunda. I think that's that must be the Surya Kunda. So that's the lake, and we will be going through that trail, and we will go from that trail. And uh, today we will be reaching to Freddy. So that's it, guys. Yo, get us to the Kunda. Are we? And here's another frozen lake. I think this is Surikunda. I didn't know the exact name. There are lots of uh, lakes like this, so it's still difficult to know the name of all the lakes. So we are taking this route. I don't know how long it will take to cross this uh, snow and mountain, but hope it will be completed by soon. So this is it, guys. Okay guys, I think this is the one, this is the Surikunda lake, uh, previous ones were, I don't know which, what's their name, but I think this is the Surikunda lake, so I'll show you the view, so look at this majestic view of Surikunda lake, just above the Gosaikunda lake, around 2 hours walk from Gosaikunda, you reach to this beautiful place. Hello everyone, now we have reached to our lunch place, it is, uh, the pl name of this place is Fedi. So after walking for about 4 hours from Gosai Kunda, uh, we are here and between uh, this Fedi and Gosai Kunda, there are no place where you can stay uh, for anything, there are no hotels, there are no villages and this is the only hotel here, uh, there was another hotel down here, down here but it is here but it's closed so after corona lockdown all the hotels on this lake are closed and only few are open so we will be having lunch here and then we will continue our walk to another destination it will be somewhere in this hill so we will have to walk for another five uh, five six hours to reach there and we will stay the night there okay so this is it i will show you the food we'll be having here and i'll also show you the surrounding of this place so see you guys this is the day three of our go cycle to trek and we are now at our lunch spot
After walking for about two hours from Fedi, we have reached to Gopte. But unfortunately, the hotel is closed. It has uh, been closed since COVID lockdown. So it's been a year. It's been closed. So now we'll have to reach to another place called Tharepati. So the path is, I think we'll have to go take that path and go up there. So it might take another two or two and a half hour for us. Uh, for us to reach there, so This is Gopte. The hotel previous was not Gopte. Uh, that was some hotel in between. And all the hotels here are also closed. So we will have to go to another place, which is Thanepati.
Hello everyone, finally we have arrived at Thare party and this is the end of day 3. So today it was a really 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 long walk. So we walked uh, from Gosai Kunda to, we did Gosai Kunda Pass, then reach Sude Kunda. Then from there we had to ascend down. It was a vertical down uh, to up to Fedi. So we had a launch at Fedi. Then from there we, uh, we started moving uh, towards Gopte and to uh, to at, at last at Thare party and uh, the path uh, on the trail uh, the trail is really amazing guys uh, at first you will see uh, a lot of mountains as well as uh, different lakes frozen as well as non frozen and from Fedi uh, to here you will see different uh, alpine trees uh, and from uh, Gopte uh, to Thare party uh, there are lots of different plants and we, we also got an opportunity to see opportunity to see different birds like Dafe, Munal and some other birds that I don't know the name of and not only that the trail was really amazing there were lots of different types of uh, trees like pine, dhupi, rhododendron etc and the flowers, wild flowers were blooming and it added the beauty uh, in the trail so it was really amazing I love the trail uh, we, I also love the mountain and lakes then later uh, the trail was really amazing guys I really loved it if I get chance I'll, I would love to uh, visit uh, on such uh, types of trails again and again and this is our hotel we will be staying here this is the back side uh, I came here because uh, I, I wanted to get the sunlight uh, the golden hour sunlight the sun is already set so the sunset was really amazing as well this place uh, has also a beautiful sunset so I'll post uh, the sunset photos as well as the auntie has said that uh, the sunrise is also amazing so I will be sharing that and uh, now we will be uh, eating lunch here and then we will take a rest uh, for today and we'll end the day 3 and tomorrow we will uh, have a breakfast here and then we will uh, start walking down to Kutunchang and I have planned to have lunch at Kutunchang and then try to reach uh, to Sundarjal if possible and from there we will go back to home so we might uh, end the this Gosai Kunda Sundarjal trek tomorrow or if not then we will end the trek uh, day after tomorrow okay